You certainly have heard a lot about turmeric, garlic, and ginger, haven't you? We talk a lot about them on our channel, since they are powerful natural medicines that help prevent and treat many diseases. Isn't that true? So in today's video, you will learn how to grow turmeric, garlic, and ginger at home. How cool is that? Because they have anti-inflammatory, antiviral, antioxidant, and antibacterial properties, these ingredients are very useful in our lives, and even more so when we follow a healthy lifestyle. Growing them at home can be very useful, and all you need is some motivation and a good dose of patience. How to grow turmeric at home The best time to plant turmeric is in early spring as it requires warm temperatures to grow. For a successful harvest, buy curcuma longa, which you can easily find at organic stores or grocery stores. Start by placing the rhizome in a water bowl. Make sure that the rhizome is not completely submerged in the water, but just on the surface. After it starts sprouting, they will need to be moved to a potless soil. Regularly water it, as turmeric needs enough water to grow. If you want to plant it directly in your garden, opt for rich soil and a sunny place. It is still necessary to water it. You can harvest your rhizomes after bloom, when the plant loses its aerial part, drying and falling off. Harvest the roots, leaving one to reproduce again. Let the roots you harvested dry in a ventilated and dry place for around 30 days until the rhizomes reach a point where they can be processed into a powder. Now just store it in a closed glass container away from heat and light. Are you enjoying the video so far? Leave a comment to let us know if we are contributing to inform you. Don't forget to like the video and share it with your friends. How to grow garlic at home. Garlic is usually planted during fall and the best garlic heads harvested you can find are usually planted mid-fall. Growing garlic at home is easy. All you need to do is put a garlic bulb in a pot with drainage and some soil. Separate the cloves, taking care not to damage the base, and bury them about two inches down, root side down. Then cover the tips with about two inches of soil and leave the pot in the sun. Water when the soil seems dry. Garlic doesn't need much water to grow. Once the stems reach around four inches of height, cut them, leaving only one inch. It concentrates all the flavor in the bulb. After noticing the stems have stopped growing, and the leaves are turning brown. It is time to harvest your garlic and repeat the procedure. When planting garlic directly in the soil, make sure to plant them about six inches apart so they have space to grow. After 10 days, you will see the first stems showing. The harvest takes six to nine months, usually when the leaves start to become yellow. Isn't it interesting? Now let's learn how to grow ginger at home. To always have some ginger at hand, Grow it in fertile and well-drained soil, in indirect sunlight or shadow. Choose the warmest months to plant ginger and protect it during the cold season. You must always water it, but it doesn't require too much water. Place the ginger pieces in the soil, giving around two inches of distance and depth between the roots to ensure ginger grows well. You will see the first rhizomes growing after a few weeks. You have to keep watering it until the rhizomes develop. To harvest them, lift a little bit of the soil, then cut the amount of ginger you want. Put the soil back in the pot and let the production keep happening unlimited. If you are growing it horizontally, opt for pots that are wider than deeper. Now you will always have these three ingredients at hand to flavor your meals and take care of your health. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. For more recipes, Side, if you ever